Hashtag socialites. Get into this. Todd Chrisley, the former star of Chrisley Knows Best, has just made a surprising accusation regarding his living conditions in federal prison camp, Pensacola, Florida. According to Chrisley, a dead cat fell from the roof into his prison food, leaving him appalled and disgusted. Chrisley maintains that he's been trying his best to get excellent meals, but alleges that employee is purposefully making it tough for him to utilize his own money at the commissary. Chrisley, 54, alleged during a recent interview on Chris Cuomo's CUOMO show, the food is dated and it's out of date by, at minimum, a year. It's a year past expiration, and they're really starving these folks to death here. These men are getting, I don't know, they're getting 1,000 calories a day. He went on to remark, you've got rats, you've got squirrels in the storage facility where the food is. They basically covered it up with plastic and then tore the roof out because of all the black mildew and found a dead cat in the ceiling and it slid down on the top of the food, he claimed. The reality star went on to claim, I've been told this by a staff member. One of the ways she's trying to break me is by cutting down what you can buy in commissary, he explained. So before she came here, you could buy 12 packs of tuna a week. She whittled it down to six, then from six it dropped to three. She has not given an explanation. When I challenged her about it, she stated commissary is a privilege, not a right. While it looks like he's merely having a very rough time in the slammer, the Federal Bureau of Prisons, FBOP, is responding to his surprising assertions. In a statement to TMZ, the FBOP states the food at the facility is safe and edible, despite Todd alleging otherwise. FBOP says that its food service mission aims to provide healthy, nutritionally sound, and appetizing meals that meet the needs of every individual. The Pensacola jail has been labeled as a minimum security federal prison camp, according to the Federal Bureau of Prisons. Even in 2009, Forbes named FPC Pensacola as the second cushiest jail in America. More on why the Chrysleys are in prison? As we previously reported, Todd and Julie Chrysley were found guilty of perpetrating tax evasion and scamming community banks out of more than $30 million in illegal loans back in June 2022. Julie Chrysley was additionally convicted of obstruction of justice and wire fraud. While Todd received a 12-year prison sentence, his wife Julie was put down seven years in prison in November of 2022. In addition to their time behind bars, they each received an order of 16 months probation from U.S. District Judge Eleanor Ross in Atlanta, news reports said. They both reported to prison earlier this year. Just because you're rich and on a Gossip Fact 24 doesn't mean that the law is not going to come get you when you commit a federal crime, U.S. Attorney Byung J. B. J. Pak previously stated.